plain movie, but cool doers in it. Hopefully you guys can see this, this is why cat's here, and this is what I got for my birthday, it's this big thing. I bought this because I was waiting to get more, um, uh, DVD sleeves to put my other, you know, these things here to put my favorites in, and then my mom's like, what should I get for your birthday, so I let her get me this. 32 bucks for this that's like cheaper than that and I can't remember what the price and then I have this one for like evers basically what I am going to show you in this video is all of my favorite movies that I don't want to lose and they're my go to uh videos where I where I watch them all the time and everything else. This in the video shows that there's a handle, like not a handle, um, this little thing that you can put on your shoulder, but it doesn't say what it attaches to, and I don't see it on here, so maybe it's just in the picture, but this one doesn't, I don't know. But I'm gonna show you this one and this one because these are my go tos. This one is, uh, not. They're my favorites, but they're my favorites, but they're my ones that I don't want to lose, but they're my go-to if I want something to watch, if I don't want to watch one of my favorite favorites. These two are my favorite favorites. So this one will be last to go through, and we'll go through these two first, and hopefully you can see these. If not, I will have to get a flashlight out, or something like that. So we're going to start with the small one. I'm going to open it first. And the first one is Roots. The OG Roots and the re Reboot Roots. The Remake Roots. Um, it's a DVD that I made but I want to get the actual DVD for that and I wish they would put bug juice on DVD as well because I got all the bug juices one through three the Highlander, Wazzy, Brush Ranch and the reason why I'm not showing you some of these is because they got my last name on it and you don't need to see that and then I've got the newest one from 2018 that kind of sucked but I still was like, well, I've got the others. It goes with it. Why not? And then I've got all the never-ending stories because the first one's my favorite. And there's the second one. And then there's the third one. And then I got a Christmas story. One and two. Because I don't want to lose those. Then I got Dazed and Confused. And the Three Ninjas. I don't know which one this one is because it doesn't say. Then I have Lack of the Irish, which I will probably be watching some either Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, because you know this is the month for it. And then um, I know on my birthday I am definitely gonna watch Trolls with Noah Hathaway. And then Baby's Kids and Not Cool with a Shane Dawson thing from YouTube. And then I got Alley Cat Strikes, Brink, Motocross, and Smart House. All my favorite Disney movies. Then I got Cry Baby, the movie version on TV version, I guess. The Smurfs, Broken Heart Club with Andrew Keegan and Duncan Jackson. I do have the DVD to Denison's Checks In, it's just, it's not my favorite, so that's why it's not in here, plus I have this one. I have it, this in here for the Broken Hearts Club and for Crybaby. Monkey Trouble, Ladybugs, is the reason why I have it in this case, not for the death of a cheerleader for a lifetime, and then some lasty episodes. 
Then I have Get Over It that I want to get on DVD for sure. And then I already have Turbo Power Ranger movie on DVD. That was before I did. And then George Lopez and Don't Tell Mom the Babysitter is Dead. Which I have the DVD for that. But the reason why for this CD is Get Over It or DVD. Some Kind of Wonderful. Sabrina the Teenage Witch the movie. But the reason... Oh, and the... This... Surrogate Trap. And the surrogate... Was... Oh, the surrogate was on Seven Heaven. Into the Storm. The reason to save this disc... DVD is Into the Storm. Quince Willow, Man of the House. I just got the DVD for Willow. And then I have the DVD for Man of the House. I just found it. So, you'll, you'll see that in this video, of course. And then the next ones that I cannot show you because of my name is Get Even with Dad, The Good Son, and Satisfaction, and I Love Lucy, Season 2 episodes, where she was pregnant. The reason for that DVD is Get Even with Dad, Satisfaction, and The Good Son, of course. Um, with Elijah Woods and Macaulay Culkin. And then A Home of Our Own, which I just got the DVD for. So that's awesome. And then some American Gladiators, of course. And then the last one is some Touched by an Angel episodes. Not all of them. Just the ones that did a collab with Promised Land. And that's why it's in there, because I don't want to lose it. So that is for that, um, for this one. Now we're going to move on to this big giant one. You can also see pictures of these DVDs on my Facebook group page, Why Cats. So if I don't put the link in the description, ask me for it and I'll get it for you and you can put it in there. I mean, you can go see all the DVDs that I actually have and own because I have over a thousand. I want to, now in this one, I want to put My Girl 1 and 2 in here. I just haven't found them yet to put them in here. But when I do, I will put them in here. And I'm going to put them right next to my Google Digger DVD. So let's get started with this. I have House Arrest and Paper Brigade because um, I just got House Arrest. It's my favorite movie of all times and the same guy in House Arrest is in Paper Brigade. And you can't watch House Arrest without watching Paper Brigade. And if you've heard of any of these movies or like to talk about any of these movies or like a review of any of these movies of what they're about, let me know in the comments down below. And I will do a review for each one of these movies. Lucas, which is a Corey Hames movie that Corey Hames and Corey Feldman do not like to talk about. I'm sorry, but Corey Hames is in it. It's a good movie. I'm sorry about what happened behind the scenes. Meatball 4. This one's really funny with Corey Feldman. The ending is my favorite scene. Uh, Snowboard Academy is really good with Corey Hames. And then Summer Rental. Joey Lawrence is in there with a guy that passed away. And I didn't want to lose this one. I don't want to lose any of my Corey Hame movies. Um, so I need to get them in here. The rest of them that I have. The two Corys. But, but I know where they're at. So I won't lose them. They're in another notebook. License to Drive with them also. And then here's the Willow DVD that I was just talking about. And you're wondering, why do you have two a days and confused? Don't judge me. If one messes up, I've got an extra one. Because I love this movie so much, I outplay it way too much. And if someone says, where's your top number one favorite movie? It's Never Ending Story um, 1, 
dazed and confused and troll in one. So yeah, I just talked and so this is and plus the one the other one I got I had to get it with Fast Days at Ridge Mill High and then at a Goodwill I saw at a thrift store I saw this one by itself so I had to get it. Uh, I home of our own. I just talked about that one in the other in this one book. And I'll be home for Christmas with Jump and Taylor Thomas. And then I got all of my three really movies, one, two, and three, because I love this movie so much. And the guy in Free Willy is also the guy in Never Ending Story three, if you didn't know that. And then True Beverly Hills, what a trip. Beverly Hills, what a trip. Well, yeah, I love that movie. Okay, I can't show you this section. I can show you those. I can show you that. I can show you that. But I can't show you the others. So, you see my face. Um, this one's called, this one is Little Giants with Devon, with, I want to call him Devon Shaw, but it's Devin Sawa, because he changed his name. My Father the Hero. Yes, the Sandlot one is on here. And That Night, which I need to get a better version of. I wish they'd have that on DVD, because I would so buy that. And this copy came from my VHS tape that is kind of messed up, but... I don't want to lose this one. I don't want to lose the movie that night and my follow the heroes, so that's why it's there. And then the next one is Sound of Music, which I have the I actually bought the DVD for and I bought the DVD for May Poppins when they were like five bucks at Target. I just don't have them in here. But I do have the DVDs to those. And I do have the DVD to explore with River Phoenix. I, with the aliens, I just don't have it in here. But I do love that movie. Then I got The Outsiders. Then I got National Lapoon's Doomsday 2, which I want to get the first one. But the reason for this DVD being in here, because I don't want to lose it, is for two movies called A Very Brady Christmas and Wild America with Sheldon Taylor Thomas and Devon Sawa. Then there's Stand By Me, Urban Cowboy with John Travolta, 10 Things I Hate About You, Alice, this is hard to read, it's Alice Through the Looking Glass, with the, which is about the Mad Hatter and why he is the way he is, and I just love that story. Okay, here's the when I was talking about where I want my girl here and then I didn't know what to put in here yet so I just left it blank but it's gold diggers um bad news bears the original I don't have bad news bears the remake because I don't like that one and I don't like the third um bad news bear original where they go to Japan but I do have it behind this second one a league of their own Beauty Shop. I have two versions of this movie because I accidentally got it twice. And so one's in here and one's in with my other DVDs. And I just love Beauty Shop. I don't know why. It's like one of my favorite movies. And of course, you know I got... Uh, I'm a huge fan of High School Musical. So you know I'm going to have those in here. And my hairsprays. The original and the remake because I love them both. Romeo and Juliet with Leonardo DiCaprio and What's Eating Gilbert Grape. I have two versions of this movie because I forgot that I bought it with Jonathan, with Johnny Depp and Leonardo DiCaprio. And then there's Real Geniuses. Love that movie. Then I got A Cinderella Story with Hilary Depp and A Cinderella Story Once Upon a Song with Luke. Lucy Hale who was on America's Juniors and I want to put her there's a third one that I want to put in this collection when I find it I also got Small Soldiers even though I got the DVD for that and Annie which I've 
which is the remake. I like that better than the original. Sorry. And I got the DVD to that too somewhere. And then the Smurfs. I got Coyote Ugly and then Stick It. Got Labyrinth Now and Then with Devin Sawa. Freaky Friday with my girl, my favorite actress, Jodie Foster. And I want to put Panic House in here when I find it. And then Raise Your Voice with Hilary Duff. Then I have Camp, the musical Camp. Then I got Camp Nowhere with Jonathan Jackson and Andrew Keegan. Little Monsters with Fred Savage and Ben Savage. So, Camp, Camp Nowhere, Little Monsters. Then I got um, Dirty, Dirty Dancing, sorry, um, Grease, The New Guy. And I love the new guy. It's a really good movie. Who's the bitch now? Motocross. Odd Girls Out is actually a true story that happens in real life through the internet. And it's a pretty touching lifetime movie. The next ones that I can't show you is Mask with it's the one with Cher. And then Mermaid, The Chocolate War, which I read the book to Back to the Future 2, because that's one of my favorites. I don't. The, I like the first one, but the second one's my favorite if I had to pick out of the Back to the Future videos, because it shows more. And I definitely don't like the third one. And I know I have one of the Back to the Future movies. On DVD somewhere in my other collection. Then there's Lassie. I just it was Lassie and Lucy and George Lopez. Some of those were just fillers to finish off the movie, the DVDs because I didn't have enough room. Then if you go way back here to the back, because I had to put these in the back, is the Karate Kid because as you can see here, I have. Quest, which I've shown you before of season three, but I have um, Cobra Kai with season one and two of Cobra Kai. Um, I didn't want to take them out of the cases because I really like these movies, so I just set these back here. But my other sequests, I have season one and two. I don't know where half of my sequests went. If I ever find them again, they're definitely going in this collection. So, that's all for this one right now. These are my top three favorites to go to when I want to watch a movie. I will put those on. Um, and then I'll show you this other case that they're my favorite movies that I don't want to lose. But they're not like something I just... I'm going to keep the key attached to this thing because, uh, no. why would you need to lock this up? It doesn't make any sense. You know, some of these I can't show you because it's got my name on it. I'll show you the inside first and then I'll show you this whole thingy with a whole bunch of CDs. I actually got 16 candles. I have almost all the Bring It On movies. This is Bring It On All or Nothing. Bring It On Again. Don't get all up in my Kool-Aid. Then I have Bring It On In It to Win It. Bring It On Worldwide Chill Smack. This one's a very weird, interesting one. But yet, a fun one to watch. Then I have... Confessions of a Teenage Drama Queen with Lindsay Lohan. Read It and Weep from Disney, of course. Ferris Bueller. I have two of these. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. 
I don't know how I, oh yeah, I got two of them because I had to. Because to get some kind of wonderful, I had to get Ferris Bueller. That was the only way. So I was like, fine, I'll get it twice. The sucky part is, after I got it, they finally had it by itself. And I was like, you bitch. The biggest fan with Chris Tuesday, R.I.P. Chris Tuesday, he died of COVID. And then we got Little Secrets. And then another version of Satisfaction. This isn't a very good version. That's why I re-got another copy of it when it was on TV. Because the one I made was really bad. And Julia Roberts in it. Then I got Steel Magnolias and Revenge of the Nerds, the first one. Because the first one is my all-time favorite. And if I had to pick my second favorite, it would be the second one because they do that that song and it called no i'm 15 no i'm 15 i don't mind the other ones they're just not my favorite the great outdoors crossroads with this one's the one with britney spears but i do want the one with watch Muccio from the cruddy kid series and cub cry i want his crossroad movie because his is good just as much as hers his is the boy version, hers is the girl version, basically. And then, oh, Mean Girls 2. And Crybaby, again. And All I Want for Christmas, even though I finally got the movie to that. And then the first Mean Girls, of course, with Lindsay Lohan. America Mall, Alice, Upside Down with Lucas from High School Musical and you know that girl that plays in Good Luck Charlie who started out vlogging and stuff before vlogging was a thing on Disney yeah she's in here as well can't turn the page okay Sleepover is a good one with the girl from Spy Kids picture this with Ashley Tisdale and Drew Sterling. No. Yeah. Uh. No, I don't think it's Drew Sterling. Sorry. Pretty Woman with Julia Roberts. Indian in the Cupboard. I read the book to that in school and it was awesome. And then Drop Dead Fred. Really good and cheesy comedy sad movie basically and that is it so if you want to see pictures of these oh wait that's not it i forgot this other section i have another zipper part <laughs> see yeah I'm just going to read these off to you real quick and show you. And if my name's across my face doing this, oh well. I don't think anybody's watching my videos anyways or give a damn. Because if you did, you would comment down below. Radio Free Roscoe Think Pink. Salute your shorts. Peter Page from Careers Road playing a game. Then we got my favorites. Which is Dream Street, Natural, Little Romeo, Chris Tuesday, or Go For It, Computer Stuff, and Britney uh, Spears, and Little Romeo that I don't want to lose. And then Gumby Bears, which is on Disney Plus, so check it out. American Choppers, because Mikey's my favorite. Then Robin Hood, the cartoon one. Um, then some stuff with Jonathan Brandis, R.P. Jonathan Brandis, Disney's New Year, Sweet Life with Zack and Cody, Boys Don't Cry, They Get Even, Dangerous Child, just a lot of good ones. And Boys Don't Cry, They Get Even it has nothing to do with the girl one. It's actually a true story. And you should check it out. It's very interesting. 
Then I got some episodes of So Weird, Step by Step, Hanging Time from back in the day. Man of the House, even though you just saw that I had the actual DVD to that. Last, Last Action Hero and Spice World. And some Smurfs. See? Then I have Big Girls Don't Cry They Get Even. Satisfaction again. Like I said, I re... Wait, did I get that three times? I think I did. Oops. I need to stop that. I need to remember my movies. Some Doogie Howser, Baby Service Club. I re-got that one because the other version I have is not very good, but this one is. So. Then I got Baby Napped. My daughter was stolen. Baby Napped is with David Gallagher um, from 2017, and it's really good. And then, if you build it, they will come. Field of Dreams. If they build it, they will come. So, yeah, I don't want to lose Field of Dreams because that's a good movie. I need to get that on DVD. Marvin's Room because for some reason I got another version and it cut off half of it which I don't know why and then I got The Good Son again because I forgot that I already had it then I got I'm Somebody's Child The Reagan Lewis Story which is a really good lifetime true story and then some Lassie The Babysitter's Club for my VHS that's not very good. That's why we got it. You Can't Take My Daughter, Lifetime Movie. Sleeping With My Student, Lifetime Movie. And then some episodes of Lassie. Bring It On, Fight to the Finish. Because I don't have that on DVD yet. But once... I do, I will def once I see it at the stores, I will definitely get it. That's a Raven season one, there's two episodes. All I want for Christmas, because I got it twice, because I forgot that I got it already. But I got the real thing now, so now I got three. For Keeps, which is a really good Molly Ring movie, and the guy from Gremlins is in it as well. It's a really good movie, you should definitely check it out. Charlotte's Web, the original. It Takes Two, a Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen movie, then some Rainbow Bright show, which I didn't know it was a show, that it was just a movie, but the movie is like the best movie ever. Like, I have a Rainbow Bright doll of my own, which you can see pictures of on my Facebook group page. And a good thing about this show, this movie, it's my favorite scene is when it's a cartoon, but the scene where they take her belt, which makes the magic. And the way they take the belt, I it, it, it just looks strange to me. And that's why I like that scene. And then I got some It's Looney. It's tiny, it's all a little loony. It's time for a tiny tune adventures. Oh wait, I know I didn't really sing the theme song that good because I don't really know it that well. But yeah, I got Tiny Tune Adventures on DVD. I got this one, that's disc, disc two. There's disc four, disc three, and disc one. And you're probably wondering who, what is these peoples? It's got baby Taz. These are the baby Looney Tunes. Where they have, um, they're like the nephews or the cousins to the others that are grown up like Bugs Bunny and stuff. And then I got Terminator 2 with 
Arnold Schwarzenegger. This one was in that tin can that you probably, not tin can, but it was tin DVD case. And I probably showed it to you before in other videos. And it comes with two discs. One of him is a ro robot, and one of him is a as him, himself. And that is it. Those are the ones I don't want to lose. And I am done. Sorry this video is so long. Let me see how long it is. Yeah, it's 30 minutes long. If you stayed all the way to the end, then please comment down below. Shark mask. And then I know you got to the end of the video. And if I ever don't remember my videos, because... God knows when this video will come out and I ask you to say something in the comments and I don't remember why I asked you to say that and I say why are you say shark mask just say because you told us to if we get to the end of the video and I'll be like oh okay yeah thank you for reminding me so and don't just go, go down to the comments and and go well I'm just gonna say shark mask because everyone else is saying shark mask when really you don't know why um if you want me to do any reviews on any of these movies let me know in the comments down below and i will and i will talk to you guys in the next video make sure you wear a mask and save a life Later haters.